Hi and welcome. Uh, in this video, we are going to discuss about last weekend's question from lunchtime, May lunchtime. Okay. So the question uh, simply says that you are given the work hours, the work hours of chef. Okay. When he is working from office for five days, that is from Monday to Friday. That is nothing but weekends. So this is given to us. This is the work hour on Monday, on Tuesday, on Wednesday, on Thursday, on Friday. Okay. So five days work hours is given and one hour of work, one hour of work at office at office is equals to P hours of work at home. P hours of work at home. Okay. And due to COVID, he has to work from home itself. Okay. So this is nothing but the value of P. So six values are given to us. This is nothing but the value of P. Now we need to know whether chef has to work on weekends also or not to complete these work hours. Okay. To complete the work hours, we need to know whether chef has to work on weekends or not. So if we are just seeing for 14, 10, 12, 6, 8 uh, in the office, what will be these hours when he's working at home? So one hour is P hours at home. So therefore 14 hours is nothing but 14 into 2, which is nothing but 28 hours at home. This is 20 hours at home, 24 hours at home. This is nothing but 12 hours at home and 18 into 36 hours at home. So this is his work hours that he need to complete in a week. He needs to complete this in a week in week days. He will try to complete these in week days. Okay. He can easily work for all 24 hours a day. Fine. We need to know whether he needs to extend on weekends or not. So it's very simple question. We just need to add all these values. If these sum is greater than 24 multiplied by 5, that means the total hours we have in five days okay if sum is greater than this then he has to work on weekends that is nothing but he has to use sunday and saturday as well so therefore in that case we will print yes but after adding all this if this sum is not greater than 24 into 5 the total work total hours present in weekdays so in that particular case we will simply print no okay so that simple question just take an array of five elements multiply it by all, all the elements by p sum all the elements and compare with 24 into 5 okay if it is yes and then no for this particular case it is no if you add it all it is not greater than 120 so therefore we will simply print yes uh, sorry we will simply print no okay that means he does not have to work on saturday sunday sunday saturday okay now in this particular case uh it is 30 30 30 30 and 30 10 multiplied by 3 if you all add it it is nothing but 150 which is greater than 120 120 is nothing but 24 into 5 okay so in this particular case we will simply write yes that he has to work on weekends because uh, the weekday hours are not enough to complete the work total hours he has to spend in the working okay so therefore in that case we will simply print yes so let's see the code for it because it is a very direct implementation to so nothing in the logical part also here so just an array of five elements a variable p taking the array as input then taking p as input here what we are doing first we are multiplying array element with p and then we are adding it into sum fine finally we are just taking if sum is greater than the value 24 into 5 we will print yes as we will print no fine a pretty straightforward implementation for a simple question okay thank you